Welcome to Jive's video tutorial series. In this video, we'll show you how to create and route calls to a dial plan. Jive's intuitive dial plan editor makes setting up advanced features like time-based routing, auto attendance, and find me, follow me quick and simple. To get started, we'll create a dial plan. To do this, click dial plans in the left navigation panel, then click new. Give the dial plan a useful name and optionally you can give your dial plan an extension if you would like to be able to transfer calls directly to the dial plan or include it in your company directory. Now we'll launch the editor to get into the configuration. I'll try to use an example that is common and fairly comprehensive. To start off, I would like my receptionist Jenny to be the front line to my company. So I'll have all calls ring her phone first. The duration for which calls will ring her line is specified here in the timeout field. After ringing Jenny's phone for 15 seconds, I'll then send calls to an automated attendant. Previously, I have recorded a message which I will configure the auto attendant to play. In this message, I allow my clients to choose from a number of options so they are routed to the correct party. From the auto attendant, I want my customers to be able to dial directly to anyone's extension. To accomplish this, I'll check the Allow Extension Dialing box in the auto attendant node. I also want a generic sales and support option that will ring to my entire sales or support teams. When a caller chooses option 1, I'll send the calls to my sales team. In order to ring the entire sales team, I'll send the calls to the sales ring group. This can be done using a simple dial node. If sales doesn't pick up, I'll send calls to the voicemail box of my sales manager, Ben. I'll also set up a similar call flow for the support team. When a customer chooses option two for support, I'll ring the support group. Then I want the calls to go to my support manager's voicemail box, but I don't want it to play her personal voicemail message. In order to play a generic support voicemail message, I'll send calls to a play sound clip node and then select the message I have previously reported. Then after playing this message, I'll route to the voicemail box. To prevent it from playing Jill's message, I'll select the No Instructions option. This way, the caller will hear the general support message, then beep directly into Jill's voicemail box. For the last auto attendant option, I want to ring Phil's extension. He is often out of the office, so I want to roll calls over to his cell phone if he doesn't answer in the office. To do this, I will use a simple dial node to ring his extension for 10 seconds then roll the calls to an external number node and enter Phil's cell phone number. Then, finally, I'll send calls to his voicemail. I've now set up a pretty common dial plan, but say I want to route calls outside of business hours to a nighttime message. This can be accomplished with a schedule node. For details on how to create a schedule, see the schedule tutorial. To implement time-based routing, I'll simply drag out my schedule node, select the schedule I'd like to use, then drag the when open option to my daytime routing, and then when closed option to my nighttime routing. To save time, I have magically had my nighttime routing appear. Now we're done. Almost. To finish it off, we need to route my phone number to the dial plan we just created. To do this, we'll click on phone numbers in the left navigation panel. Select the appropriate number, edit the behavior, and select the dial plan extension. That's it. There still are many more features available to you in the dial plan that we did not cover. Details of these are covered in further documentation. 
This concludes our tutorial. We hope this has been helpful and we thank you for choosing Jive.